Well, it is baseball heaven for fans of America's pastime. As Betsy said, the fireworks are going off. The MLB All-Star Game is Tuesday. But until then, Clevelanders can have some fun at the Play Ball Park. The five-day event kicked off this morning, and Ray Strickland, who's been having some fun himself all day long, joins us live downtown. Okay, so you accepted my challenge for the Velcro wall earlier, and you didn't fall off. Did you ever get up on that zip line? Are you going to keep calling me out about that, Danielle? No, I did not get on that zip line, but come Monday, uh, I will do so. So I will probably post that on social media for people to see. But I did have fun, uh, as you saw, with the Velcro wall. And a lot of people, like myself, had fun too here on the outside uh, of down or say outside of the Huntington Convention Center in downtown Cleveland on the malls here. Uh, you can probably see people walking uh, behind me. That's because a concert just wrapped up on Ma B uh, featuring 21 pilots. They just uh, performed, and that was amazing. The fireworks uh, will let you know. Know that for sure but a lot of people uh, had fun on the inside as well inside of the uh, Huntington Convention Center where I spoke to uh, a lot of people there and they say they were pretty impressed uh, with the play ball park the day started with a ceremonial first pitch to officially kick off the play ball park at Huntington Convention Center and surrounding malls in downtown Cleveland ahead of this year's 2019 MLB All-Star Game. Downtown, Clevelanders and fans who came across the country enjoyed the interactive fan fest, which included zip lining 120 feet in the air. But that's only outside. I've never seen a convention center look so good right now. Inside the convention center, it can be described as the Comic-Con of baseball. Parents like Tariq Mitchell brought his son Jojo to take it all in. I've enjoyed this and I wish this could go on from year to year. You're going to have a great time. You can't see everything all in one day. Well, you can at least try, like taking a swing at the virtual reality home run derby. Mike Viverka and myself loved it. The vision's a little bit blurry if you're not used to it, but other than that, what a great time. There's also a home plate bouncy house, a Velcro outfield wall exhibit, which includes the history of the Negro Leagues and so much more. All of this only costing you $10 Sunday through Tuesday. Maybe the best days to come because Saturday the tickets will be regular price at $25. And if you aren't too tired, a free concert will finish the first two nights at Play Ballpark. The crowd loving the performance now of 21 Pilots. Saturday, the Killers will perform, fitting as it was surely a killer time in downtown Cleveland. So what a day and night it was here in downtown Cleveland. And the great thing about this is it goes on for another four days through Tuesday, which means, Danielle, I will get on that zip line on Monday. I promise you I will not chicken out. I know. I know I'm not thinking you're going to chicken out. I'm dying to do it. And that's why I wanted to watch you do it. So I'm going to try to get out there as well. I love that stuff. I was, I was just about to say you better do it, too. Oh, I totally will. <laughs> and I'll take video of it. We'll compare. All right. All right. Thanks so much.